So what you're gonna need is obviously a mirror that is at least 10 times zoom. So I get one of those. You obviously need, you need a tweezers. Basic tweezers, does not matter. I always get have handy these, it's a pair of scissors. I don't know where I got these, but you can just find brow scissors at a drugstore. And then the last thing you're gonna need is brow tint. I'm using Ulta's brow tint, and I think the kind that's best to use is a kind that is kind of old. Now, this one's kind of new because I threw the other one away, it just got too dry. But a drier one is better instead of a new one, and you will see why in just a second. So what you're gonna wanna do is obviously when you've washed your face, everything is off your face, don't moisturize around your eye, eyes and everything. If you wanna moisturize your face so you don't feel like it's falling off and everything like that, from dry skin, I totally get that. So moisturize up here and around, but leave your eyebrow area unmoisturized. Then what you're gonna wanna do is take your eyebrow tint, well you could go as go ahead and pluck the ones that you see automatically. Go ahead and pluck those. But then take this and you're going to just run this very lightly up and down across your face, across your eyebrow. You're going to look crazy, I get that. But you're going to just very lightly go the opposite direction and what you're gonna do is this eyebrow tint is going to catch on all those tiny little hairs. Now I'm showing you guys what it looks like as I'm talking. And I will tell you that it does not pick up on all the little hairs, it just doesn't. The camera will not get it. But when I look in my mirror, I totally see all these hairs all of a sudden come to light and I can go ahead and pluck them. So make sure when you're doing this, you're not using any permanent kind of brow gel kind of thing. This is water soluble. I can wash it off right with a washcloth and water and I'm fine. So don't worry about that. It'll come right off. In fact, I do it a couple times. I will go and do a per, you know one swipe through, a couple swipes through, whatever. I'll pluck and I'll wash it all off again, and then I'll do it again until I don't see any more hairs. Now, while you're doing, if you see ones way up here and stuff that you can give with the razor, go ahead and use the razor to do that. Or if you wanna try waxing it, I, I don't know. I'm not a waxer, so I don't know. But try it, if that's what you already do. So this works like a charm. It is amazing. Now, I don't do that every day. I just pluck stray ones as I go, but probably like once a month, I will do this little trick where I will get all the hairs off and I'm all nice and clean. Oh, I love it. I'll usually do my face shaving at the same time that I do it. No, I don't use that to bring up all those hairs on my face. That's unneeded because I can just take my razor and get them off. But to get all those little hairs, it works wonderful. Now, I also use it above my lip. Sometimes, I feel like I don't see it all again and sometimes it is hard to get the razor like really in here without cutting myself I need to be careful so sometimes I do want to pluck them so that's another way you can use it and it'll shine all those things up and you will see them and you'll be like how did I miss all that hair I have literally done this system and seen a hair that was like a half inch long and it was completely blonde and it it fell flat on my face, so I didn't even know it. It was like the weirdest thing. <laughs> I don't know if anyone else saw it. I really hope not. But guys, this is just like, I was so excited when I discovered this little hack. So I hope that you guys are able to try, try it. Make, you know, find one that's kind of dry. If you have to get a new one, go ahead. You might want to wipe a lot off, like get it and you know scrape it on the sides a lot. I'm probably going cross-eyed looking at this. Um, so that it's mostly off of it. And then remember, just go very gently so you don't get more of the skin, you get just the hairs. So let me know if you try this and it works for you. I, I'm hoping it does. It works really well for me. And guys, a thumbs up is always the best compliment. If you try it, let me know, comment below. And if you haven't subscribed, consider doing that. If you have any questions about that, please feel free to comment below as well as on my eyebrow hack. And I will see you guys in the next video. God bless.